Industries. Today I'd like to introduce you to a very exciting product that we have here at Zern Wilkins. It's our 300 AR series replacement backflow prevention assemblies. We've developed a product that will fit into a longer lay length uh, area out in the field whereby you're removing an older backflow prevention assembly that can no longer be repaired. What we've done here at Wilkins is we've taken a standard backflow body and in between the body and the outgoing shutoff valve we install a custom length spool. This spool can be made at various lengths so again what we're trying to accomplish is the replacement of a much longer lay length backflow preventer out in the field. We've got an accompanying video we'd like for you to watch here. This video has been sped up approximately 700 times, but the total installation time from taking the original backflow preventer out to finishing the job was a scant 35 minutes. So we hope you enjoy this video. Take a look at it and as we go along, I'll describe some of the features and benefits and some of the things that they're actually doing out in the field. At this installation site, we have an old double check valve assembly, in fact a very old double check valve assembly that's needing replacement. What they're doing right now is they're preparing to take this double check valve out and once again they're going to replace it with a much more current device. The valve that they're going to use is a Zern Wilkins 300 AR series uh, reduced pressure principle assembly. So the exact model number in this case would be a 375 AR. Again, speaking to the purpose of the valve, you can see in this, as they take this older valve out, it's quite a long assembly. Well, most modern assemblies are much shorter than what we made in the past. And if we were to try to install it without the AR features, we would have to change all of the risers and the piping associated with this old double check valve assembly. That's going to result in a considerable amount of time, and it's also going to be very, very, very expensive to do that. So again, as you see, they're, they're preparing to pull out this double check valve assembly, and again, we're going to install a Model 375 AR in its place. It's certainly going to save these guys a tremendous amount of labor. Now, right now, they're loosening up the flanges on both ends of this assembly, and we've got a large forklift here. We're going to go ahead and lift this assembly out of place. The assembly's been picked up. Again, this valve is quite old. Uh, now you can see we have the two risers. Uh, we're cleaning off the gaskets here and, and preparing those gasket faces for new gaskets and the installation of the Zern Wilkins 375 AR reduced pressure principle assembly. In the, the double check that we had in place here, uh, just a normal double check, but there's certainly some other interesting features and benefits that are provided by the 300 AR series product. Had this particular valve been, say, a double check detector assembly, it would have been fitted with supervisory switches on the shutoff valves. Well, by putting in a, a much uh, shorter lay length backflow preventer, again, we would have had to readjust the piping risers, we would have had to shorten everything up. Uh, dug tremendously large pits, etc. But we would have also had to change the electrical had that backflow preventer had supervisory switches. By going with the AR valve, we're using the exact same lay link that was in place before, and that prevents us from having to change any electrical or, again, having to alter the risers that the valve is bolted to. In this sequence, you can see the gentlemen are installing the 375 AR. And to, to give you what the valve embodies, it's basically a normal backflow preventer, but we've installed a spool in between the body of the backflow preventer and the outgoing shutoff valve. Now, this is not something that Zern Wilkins has arbitrarily decided to do. This is a fully approved product. It's gone through all of the approval procedures. We've gained approval from all of our approval authorities. So again, it's not just a fly-by-night product. This is an approved product. It's intended to be this way, and all of the code authorities have backed Wilkins and given us an approval for this product. Here the gentlemen are just going ahead and tightening up the flanges, the incoming and outgoing flanges, installing gaskets, etc. And once they get all their flange bolts put into place, they'll tighten those flanges up, and the valve will be ready to be commissioned. Now the, 300, the 375 series AR valve now is fully installed. What these gentlemen are going to do is just finish tightening up all of their uh, flanges, make sure everything is leak free. 
And as we mentioned earlier on in the beginning of the video, total installation time for this large valve was 35 minutes. So tremendous time savings are provided by the 375 AR valve. The flanges have been tightened up, starting to clean up their tools. Again, we're going to commission this valve by opening up our inlet, uh, letting the valve fill, bleeding air out of our test cocks. And once we get the, system, the valve filled, then we can go ahead and crack our outgoing shutoff valve to fill the remainder of the system. We're putting our pipe supports underneath the valve just to, just to give that additional support. And again, that may be covered by your local codes. They may require you to put it, install pipe supports. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our OneZern YouTube channel. For more product information or to speak to a customer care representative, please visit our website at zern.com.